Poulet Donkey Cheese is the most expensive cheese in the world. Produced by only one farm in the world, Poulet will cost you about $600 for a single pound. Making it requires more time and effort than most other cheeses. You need over six and a half gallons of donkey's milk just to make one kilogram of cheese. That's two and a half times more than what you need to make mozzarella. So how does Poulet compare to other types of cheese? And why is it so expensive? Even in the diverse world of cheese, Poulet is unique. There's only one place in the world that makes it, and that's on this farm in the Zasavisa Special Nature Reserve. Slobodan Simic founded the reserve 24 years ago in Serbia. It's one of just three areas in all of former Yugoslavia that protects a special endangered breed of Balkan donkey. Poulet is made with 60% donkey milk and 40% goat milk, and it requires months and many donkeys to produce it. Osnovna naša ideja kad su magarci u pitanju da tu vrstu koja je spala ispod 1000 jedinki u Srbiji spasemo, tad smo rešili da napravim prvu farmu muznih magarica. Dakle, ovde su poenta je na muzni magarica. Proizvode, a kad smo došli do 200 magarica, kad smo imali višak mleka, onda sam ja mislio da treba da pravimo i sir. There are only about 20 donkeys that produce milk on the farm at a time. And even then, each one won't produce much. Each donkey is milked carefully by hand three times a day. If the farmers don't empty all the milk, the donkeys won't continue making it. We tried to use machines, but it didn't happen because she wasn't designed as a cow to give milk, but only a pool of sisa, and that's why when you put the machine apparatus, it will block it and it won't give milk. Today, farmers care for 250 donkeys, but they can't always take milk from all of them. Similar to cows, a female donkey will only produce milk once it's had a baby, and each one carries a baby for a year and two weeks. Then farmers must wait another three months once the baby has taken milk for itself, before they can begin gathering their own to make cheese. They need 6.6 .6 gallons of milk in total to make just one kilogram of cheese, and a donkey produces under one gallon of milk per day. That's far less than what comes from a cow, which can produce as much as 15 gallons of milk a day. Each donkey will only produce milk for six months. Then you must wait another year to collect milk from that same donkey again. Poulet is only sold on this farm and a few others the reserve partners with, another factor that ups the final value. The farm can produce between 50 and 70 kilograms of cheese a year, but Slobodan only ever sells about a third of that. And it's not just because of Poulet's staggering price. You couldn't legally buy Poulet cheese in some parts of the world, even if you wanted to. Stojke i pije se isključivo nekuvano to mleko, što je isto dodatni problem za plasiranje tog mleka u Evropsku uniju, jer nepasterizovano nekuvano mleko se ne može prodavati u Evropskoj uniji. A ovo ako se pasterizuje, onda se izgube svi ti dragoseni sastojci i onda je to obična stvar koja nije vredna. Technically, Poulet cheese can be produced with milk from any type of donkey, and therefore any farm that raises donkeys. But there's one major roadblock. Just having donkey's milk doesn't mean you have all you need to make this cheese. Poulet is made in a very specific way, using a recipe only Slobodan and one other person in the world knows. It's because donkey milk contains less fat than the milk of other animals, which means it holds less of the protein casein that allows many other cheeses to coagulate on their own. The recipe requires goat milk and a secret mix of additives and bacteria. This is what allows the milk to form curds, an essential stage of any cheese-making process. Without this, it wouldn't be possible to make pule at all. Pa ne može da napravi niko, ne samo kod kuće, nego su poznati stručnjaci za mleko iz raznih zemalja pokušavali to da naprave i nisu uspeli. Zato što je ono što je tehnolog Smislio. To su dodaci određenih bakterija i drugih substanci koji uspeju da zgrušaju to mleko, koje ima, inače malo ima to kazeina koji, koji služi za zgrušavanje mleka, i onda su mnogi probali, ali ni, niko nije uspeo da napravi. The cheese is finally placed into 50 gram molds to age for a few days. Once removed from the molds, it's set in another room to age for at least a month more. The final product is crumbly and soft with a rich flavor. Bravo, jedinstveno i posebno. 
The cost of preserving the donkey species is another element to keep in mind when considering Pule's huge value. Slobodan must maintain the land, buy food for the donkeys, and hire workers to care for them. In a year, he spends about $100,000 just to keep the farm running. And unless producing Pule becomes easier, or someone else in the world discovers how to make it, nothing is likely to bring down the price of this incredibly rare Serbian cheese. Ali u životu postoje momenti kada nešto otkrijete, kad dođete do nečeg i onda osjetite da je to moment da se tome posvetite. To sam ja uradio i neka je se i vrlo sam sretan zbog toga što sam ovakav jedan rezervat napravio sa mojim prijateljima, drugovima itd.